Peace, what up? So it's your man D-Prime215 here. Uh, my prediction for Money in the Bank 2019, AJ Styles versus Seth Rollins for the Universal Championship is for Seth Rollins to retain and AJ Styles to lose, of course, but not only lose the match, but to full out um, turn heel. Uh, just based on the history of AJ Styles the past five years, um, every time he has turned heel, he has turned heel with the club so I expect the club to get involved um, one way or another whether um, is during the match or after the match however it happens I don't know if the match will end clean or not but I do expect AJ to turn heel I think now is a good time for him to turn heel uh, this is however this is not the first time AJ and Seth have wrestled each other one-on-one -on -one. Um, it is the first time in WWE but they did have a match in the Indies uh, well over a decade ago in which AJ won and uh, Seth was known as Tyler Black at the time. Um, AJ actually put Seth over after the match saying like something along the lines of um, Seth Rollins being the future of uh, wrestling, which was very big because AJ doesn't do that often. So he clearly felt uh, highly about Seth Rollins or Tyler Black at the time rather. Um, but something else kind of bigger about this, like one, I do think this is a bit early. Um, I know it has been over a decade since they wrestled each other one-on-one. -on -one. They have wrestled each other in WWE in tag matches. They've wrestled with each other in tag matches, like teaming on the same side. They've been in, um, I believe they had at least, they've had a few multi-man matches um, in WWE as well. Uh, triple threat, things of that nature. So I do get it's the first time in over a decade they wrestled each other one-on-one. -on -one. Uh, they've been in WWE for three years. It's the first one-on-one -on -one match there. I do think it's a bit early. Seth just got the belt about a month ago, WrestleMania. AJ just, just got drafted to Raw. And I felt like Drew McIntyre would be a better fit for the first challenger, either him or The Miz. But we're getting AJ and Seth early. It's not at one of their larger pay-per-views like a SummerSlam or WrestleMania. So a lot of people feel that it, it's rushed. You can make the argument that Money in the Bank is one of WWE's top five pay-per-views. You know, you have... Uh, Royal Rumble, Survivor Series, WrestleMania, and SummerSlam. Uh, I've read in a few sources that Money in the Bank is like their fifth uh, highest grossing pay-per-view. Um, who knows, you know, but um, of course I would prefer for it to be either on SummerSlam or WrestleMania, but we're getting it now. Uh, I, I feel like the match will go incredibly well. Something else I noticed uh, that's very interesting about the AJ in Seth Rollins feud um, I feel like it probably won't be booked like this given how WWE tends to run great feuds into the ground by giving us multiple matches and uh, a bunch of non-finishes and it doesn't really make sense. But I look at AJ and Seth Rollins and I see it kind of like this, this similarity in their feud, like their age difference in their experience as I do with uh, Kazushiko Okada and Hiroshi Tanahashi. Now, granted, AJ is like, he's in his 40s now, so I don't know if they'll have, you know, 13 matches like Okada and Tanahashi did, but I do think there's a propensity there for them to have a series of that caliber. Um, again, this is WWE, so I don't expect it to be of that caliber, but I think it's a very interesting situation there. So overall, I expect for Seth Rollins to go over. AJ will turn heel. Um, I wish it was at, you know, one of the other pay-per-views, but we're getting it now. I have no doubt that this match will go over well. Um, I do expect, however, this won't be the end of their saga. I expect them to wrestle multiple times uh, for the Universal Championship over the course of the next uh, three to four months at least. But, you know, I, I expect Seth to go over at Money in the Bank. That's my prediction. WWE, do not mess this one up. You messed up uh, Kevin Owens and AJ. You messed up Shinsuke Nakamura and AJ. Uh, I, look, man, just let this let this one make sense. Whatever happens, happens, but let it make sense. So that's my prediction for Money in the Bank. It's too sweet. They're gonna burn it down. Will AJ build the house back up? Who knows? Uh, I just hope you know the match just goes over well. What lies for AJ after this? I have no idea. We'll find out. But that's my prediction. Seth will go over. AJ will turn heel and make sure you subscribe to D Prime 215 for 
more content, more consistent content. As always, I've been going hard for the past year between hip-hop and wrestling and everything, so stay tuned.